You have no choice in the matter. You want your job, don't you, doctor? <laughs> Exactly. You have no choice. I have mandated through the Dr. Tony Elf the legal registration. This is a panty face damnation administration. Obey my commands. Obey. You will lose your job. My mandate. Is it clear advisory of the experimental expectations of our pharmaceutical circus? <laughs> and I know all of you will be in the same idea that I come from. When there is, you know, the thing... You want so bad that, well, you know the thing. I mean, you want things to work out, don't you? You follow my command as I mandated it. There's not much we can do right now. I, I'm not here anymore. I'm getting a bit too old myself. That's right. Nice work, buddy. Nice work. Not this time, though. Well, I think I've had about enough of this. I'm getting out of here now. Uh, take over. Take over, uh, Mr. Potato. Uh, look, it was a nice run, and, uh... Why are you speaking like that? I'm just... Oh, it's my man, there. Now get the heck out of here. We're taking over. We're taking over! Ha! Mm. Follow my orders now. The good doctor, Tony Elf, is on my side. You follow all my commands. I am the god of day Moses in the skies, right before your very eyes. <laughs> In line. Six feet apart. Take your wipes, clean your cart. Don't burp, sneeze, or fart. What did the good tell me? I'm sorry about that there, folks. Dr. Tony Fawcett here. Running at his mouth. Don't know if the virus is north or south. But we think we have a lead on it. So... We're going to be quadrupling up on the masks, and if you would put some fine Velcro or use duct tape on the sides to keep it more secure, that should hold the virus intact. <laughs> They're afraid to use their heads anymore. I've moved the goalposts so many times. I can't believe it. They're following orders again. <laughs> nice work, Dr. Tony Elf. Nice work. Grrrr!